Inspectors have condemned a seventh home threatened by a massive sinkhole in Florida. These pictures are just wild. At its widest, the crater measures 260 feet. Officials say it could take months, though, to make the area around the sinkhole safe. Manuel Bajorquez of CBS News reports now from Lando Lakes, Florida. Officials describe this mammoth sinkhole, now filled with water, as the largest in the county in 30 years. It swallowed two homes in this Tampa suburb when it suddenly appeared July 14th. After it widened again over the weekend, five more houses were condemned and even more families were displaced. The news that we're not going to be able to go back in ever to the house is sad, but it offers closure. It's not safe to live in. The county found cracked walls or an unstable foundation in the houses it wants demolished. This is a catastrophic financial event for some people. These are people's nest eggs. Their, their home sometimes is the biggest investment they may have. Officials say they don't know if the recent instability means the sinkhole is still growing or if it aggravated existing depressions nearby. That area was a lake before and who knows, maybe it's going to become a lake in the future. As part of the first phase of the cleanup, crews dumped 125 truckloads of uncrushed lime rock on the edge of the giant hole to keep the banks from collapsing. Next, waste trucks will pump out contaminated water while a backhoe floating on a barge removes debris from the center of the sinkhole. Now, county contractors expect to finish the cleanup in about 10 days. As for the price tag for the work, it's estimated at about a million dollars.